Good evening, everybody. Let me just, oh. Let me just turn it down. I wanted to do some sharing. Let me just turn that down. Okay, share in a post. There we go. It's, everything's working differently today. So good evening. I'm just going to say hello to a few people in a second. But I'll talk to you first because I've, I've been a bit poorly, everyone. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So I've been a little bit quiet. Um, I'll explain all to you in a minute, but you can probably see I've got a really poorly face at the moment. I'm trying to sit back and trying to turn at an angle so you can't see so much because it's uh, it's really painful. But I will explain all in a minute. Let me say hello to a few people. Emma has been there since about half past six. Bless your heart, Emma. Good evening. Good evening, Miriam. You weren't far behind. Hi, Dawn. Hi, Doreen. Hi, Samantha. Hi, Karen. Hi, Francine. Hi, Vicky. Hi, Laura. Hi, Con. Hi, Shirley. Hi, Christine. Hi, Lindsay. You're still awake then, Lindsay. You made it. Bless your heart. Um, hi, Hayley. Hi, Donna. Hi, Kathy from the States. I know that name. No Taffy yet. No Taffy yet. Hi, Sam. Hi, Jan. Hi, Lynn. Hi, Shelley from Michigan. I was going to say Michigan. Got some good news for you guys. Um, hi, Lorraine. Hi, Jean. I don't know if I can tell you yet, though, Shelley. I wish I could. Hi, Di. Hi, Dawn. Hi, Molly. Hi, Adele. Hi, Chrissy. Huh. Hi, Jan. Hi, Helen. Hope you're well, Helen. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Jean. Um, is there anybody new here as well? If you are new, put new, 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 and we'll make sure we say hello to everybody who's new and give you a lot of details of the way things, way we do things and uh, what we've got coming up. So, hi, Otter Lady. Hi, Nikki etc etc hi beverly hi kieran it is another warm evening here on the coast isn't it neighbor hi pat another neighbor um could you do me the honors please could you do the liking and sharing so you can be in with the chance of winning the goodies of this week they're really lovely goodies as well so they're really nice you're going to really 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 like these a bit different but really good really really I don't know, you know, I always say everything works together, and yes, it does. So if you share, when you see it in a minute, you'll go, mm, I get it, I get it now. So please, please, if you can. And I've got a little bit of chatting to do as well. And I do know, I do expect, I think um, viewing figures tend to go down over the summer because everyone's in their garden and they tend to catch up a bit later. So I, I will leave it a little bit longer. We've got we've got 230 two of you here so not too shabby so i will get cracking in a minute but let me just um talk to you um yeah i am so sorry i've i've been quite poorly over the past couple of days um i'm just going to keep it brief because it, it's just something that happens to me so if i ever go off quiet you know why um i don't know if any of you have any of you ever noticed but sometimes my lip swells just at the top here and at the side um but where I've had a couple of quiet days and I've kind of chilled down a bit, I think my body's gone, oh, and then infections have started and I developed this and I suffer terribly from cold sores and I'm under the doctor for them and I take medication, regular medication for them and it makes my lips swell and things. And I, I can normally keep it under control, but this one hit me like a bolt out of the blue. It was just horrific. The side of my face was sore. I mean, Sue... So, Sue Peach, who comes to help, even she said, oh, God, Lisa, that looks awful. It looks so sore. The side of my face was all swollen. Um, it looks like Danny's given me a good a good, good right arm there, but I, I can assure you he hasn't. Um, so if I'm, you can see probably here now, at that angle, it's quite, um, it's quite, it's very, very sore. It's very sore in my mouth. So if I keep drinking and things, it's because my face is sore. And I can't, I can't do much about it. Just, I don't know if anybody else here suffers from cold sores or anything, but I tell you, those of you who do, I'm sure will appreciate how utterly. Oh, it just it, it's well. I don't know why it does it, but it, it it 
I think it's the nerve endings, but it, it makes me cry. And not through, it is painful, ridiculously painful, but not that. I just kind of get all weepy and um, I feel really low and it gives me a terrible headache and a toothache. It's just a, a really unpleasant thing. But it's, you know, there are a lot worse things that happen to people at sea. So let's be... So if you think what is going on with her face today, that is what it is. But I nearly didn't do the live because I was a bit conscious of it. But I thought, you know what? No, no, you're all my friends here and, um, and I'm sure it won't bother you. As much as it bothers me, Danny keeps saying it's not as doesn't notice as much as you think he does. But I think he's just being nice to me. But the swelling's gone right down now. Now I'm on my tablets, which is a good thing. So really good to see you all here blimey we've gone up in that in that brief space oh from can hi suzette good news for you as well suzette hopefully um hi valerie hi sue hi helen hi Nettie. oh loads of you hi jenny brilliant fabulous oh christina scott you are making a fresh peach and blackberry cobbler fresh peaches and a few blackberries from the garden. How gorgeous. Hi, Jill. Hi, Jill. Some positive. Oh, Jill. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. I'm just so sorry. Oh, bless you. Well, let's see if we can just keep give you some positivity. We're sending lots of virtual hugs from all of us, I'm absolutely sure. So it's really lovely to see you here. It really is. So thank you. And bless your heart. Bless your heart. Brilliant. Okay, so you've all liked and shared. You're doing good. You're doing good. Sam, you feel my pain? Oh, I'm on a... They, I take these tablets. They're um, the... The Zyvirax stuff that you take is something like two milligrams in the tubes. And I have to take 800 milligram tablets five times a day at the moment just to keep things at bay. Because otherwise it just, I look like a, a bit like that. It's still a bit like that, but not it's not too bad. It looks like a bit of a shadow. Okay. Oh, tablets, the tablets have kicked in. So, yeah, it's... um. Tina's on her way to Bournemouth. Oh my goodness, have an awesome time. So where is everybody? Are you all are you all in the garden? Are you please don't tell me you've got me dodgy face on the big screen because I've been sitting there like that all night just in case. So where are you all from? Have you been busy? Oh Julie, please don't look at my face. <laughs> I don't make me laugh because I can't laugh either. Oh, fabulous. But here we go. Here we go. Let's start. What was that? I just missed that. I just missed something there. Do you know what? I just saw, I, my my um lysine, ma yeah, lysine, Mary. I do take lysine, but I also used to take Holland and Barrett used to do it in a little jar and you could put it on your lips, but they just discontinued it and it's awful because it was so good. But lysine, yeah, I think it's about 500 grams. Obviously, it's turning into a medical lesson, isn't it? Now, but yeah. <laughs> It's almost dark in your garden. Goodness me. Hi, Lindsay. You're on the big screen. You look gorgeous there. I'm chilling on my bed and hubby's doing his diamond art. I want to get some diamond art. I want to give that a go because I think that would be really calming. What I have got is a felting kit that I bought of a gorgeous hair. And that's what I really want to do. I want to really sit down and take some time to do something different other than because I love crafting, but it's kind of like a busman's holiday, so I don't get away from it, really. So I think trying to do a different craft might chill me out a little bit. So, oh, it so, looks like it's sunny everywhere. Oh, thank you, Jackie. <laughs> oh, I love you all. Thank you. So, right, first thing we're going to do, first thing we're going to do is, let me have a drink. And... Um, just want to say to you all thank you thank you so much I can't believe I cannot believe craft awards how how many categories I've been nominated in I'm I actually I got really upset when I saw it in a positive way and um it was quite emotional really because I you know one of my friends said to me oh congratulations on being nominated 
it's all live now and everybody knows and i hadn't got the email so i hadn't seen it. i was like what 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 and then um i i emailed them and said um i didn't get an email about nominations and they said oh yeah and they gave me the list of categories wow so just thank you do you know what to be in some of these categories with some of these crafters who are so up there on their game i am blown away i appreciate the time you took to, to nominate me um and again now the voting started so do you know what i'm eternally grateful if you're voting for me i know it takes just a couple of minutes but it does mean the absolute world and even Danny, you know, it's not just me, it's Danny as well. Danny, you know, best customer service nomination. What an incredible achievement, an incredible achievement. Designer of the year, you know, female of the year. I'm never gonna get I'm never gonna get these awards. Just but just to be nominated in the categories is just thank you, thank you. Um make sure you tell your friends though <laughs> no i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking um but yeah nominations have reopened so if you do want to vote for me now you've nominated me so the pre the nominations were previously for getting me onto that short list and now i'm on that list it's just deciding who your favorites are i'm not going to sit here and say um who you should be voting for or give you my recommendations or my suggestions um just there are some fantastic crafters out there. Just vote for who who you think is worthy of it. So, but thank you. Thank you so, so much. And that's that. I was upset you couldn't vote. Oh, no. I thought you could vote. You, you only didn't get the best sewing machine from me because I don't sew. <laughs> don't make me laugh. Don't make me laugh. Where is the voting? If you go to you, if you go to Lisa Horton Crafts page, I think I've actually put a big there's a big pink banner on that says vote here, or I'm sure somebody will put a post here for me. And it's the Crafts Crafts Beautiful Awards. And then um I think you do Crafts Beautiful and it will it when you put it into Google, it will come up with awards 2022 and it will say vote here. So thank you thank you and the awards aren't just for me and danny they are for all all my team as well so and that that's just to be nominated so i'm eternally 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 grateful so thank you very very much indeed so now i've done that bit and i'm probably going to keep thanking you every week just for continuing to vote because it's open for so long you're going to get sick of hearing me talk about it but i'm just so bowled over by the whole thing i can't quite get my head around it it's just good anyway thank you i missed the beginning what what have you done to your face i've got a oh just um a horrific outbreak of a cold sore which is um something i've been suffering for for the past 20 odd years of my life but um i normally keep it under control sonia but i just haven't kept it under control this time and it is absolutely it's completely debilitated can't speak de de debilitated me and it looks horrific and i I'm, i've gone into hiding but i decided no do you know what i'm doing the live tonight so i was going to go and hide away from it but i'm not right so i'm a week early actually so you think you're probably thinking why why is she doing a show and tell tonight this is a bit weird she's not on for a little while yet and no i'm not on i'm not on till the 26th um yeah it's not it's not a uh, sun breakout it's like it's a no it's it's a bit worse than the sun but i know it doesn't help does it cassie um why am i doing this early i'm doing this early because i think what's been working really well and what worked well last time is i think we did a a live early so we told you about stuff early and then the just before it went live on creating craft we did a demo so tonight i'm going to tell you what's going to be on and then next friday we're going to demo and we're going to demo what is on and then on the tuesday i go to tv so um quite a lot to tell you about tv so i've got a one day special which launches on i think it's tuesday tuesday the 26th it's the 26th anyway i know that much it's 6 p.m 9 p.m 10 a.m and 2 p.m okay so that's the one day special and then i'm zipping back to my hotel 
and I'm going to get up early the following day and you can then find me on Craft Extra. Now, if many of you don't know, Craft Extra was the original channel that Hochanda was on. Um, and when they bought Creating Craft, they moved everything back up to the, it all stayed on the Creating Craft channel. But uh, Craft Extra is now pretty much run by the fabulous Dawn Wheeler. And I'm going to be going in to demonstrate for four hours during the course of the day. So it will be 10 and 11 and then one and two. So I'll get an hour break. So you've got me for two full hours, one hour break, two full hours. And I only know the sky details, but it's channel 673. So that's on the 28th. So the, the show proposals are different. The Create and Craft show one day special on the 26th is new product, which it, it normally is for a one day special. And then the 28th is stuff I'm bringing back that I want to demo with you, but it's also the odd new item as well. The thing, um, I think Kathy, one of the girls will tell you how to watch Create and Craft Extra. It's something to do with the red button on your remote control. But that's all I know. I can just tell you it's Sky 673. Somebody might know if it's um, if it's on YouTube. I'm not actually sure, but I would do. I would see what I can find out for you to see to make sure we we can get you watching it. Um, Pat, I don't think it has to be on Sky. I'm not sure. I will see what I can find. I think you might have to watch it online some of you some of you but i'm not sure is that a shadow from your hair no it's bruised here look it's all bruised it's all everything it's really look there can you see it this is all from my face it was massive massive but it's all it's a just a it's a horrible thing but it's all kind of mm, it's getting better is all i can say all i can say it's bizarre isn't it mm, yeah but it looks like I've painted some pen on my face or something, doesn't it? Watch and then press the red. Yeah, so uh, somebody will be able to help me. If you're watching, yes, if you're watching Crate and Craft via Smart TV, you can press the red button for extra. Thank you, Kieran. Hi, David. I think you need to be on channel 85 and then press the red button. So, Pat, that might help you. Looks like plenty of you are helping answer there, which is fabulous. There we go. So, so the 26th is the one day special, and then the 28th is the um, craft extra. But we're going to go through it all. So what I'm going to do is, again, I've taken my nails off as well. I'm, I'm trying to um, chill out a little bit and, and sort my body out a bit. And I think this, the... The stresses and strains of crafting over the past couple of, couple of months have um, taken it out of my body a little bit. So I'm going to turn you over to the overhead. So excuse my nails. <laughs> Stop stalling. Um, I'm stalling because I don't know what to show you first. Come on then. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let me get you over. Let me get you over. So... So, so, so. <laughs> now, thank you, Karen. Look at this. Thank you, Sue. It does look better today. Sue took a picture of me and it was like ridiculously um, <laughs> bad. I wouldn't have come on yesterday. But let's talk about dice. It's no more talking about faces. It's not interesting. So one day special. Let's, let's take away a lot of it. Let's do the first part for you. Bundle, not a mega bundle, not a mega expensive bundle. It is cool, and you've been waiting for this because it's been in the magazines, and everybody's been saying, Where can I find that? Where can I find that? And I've been going, It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. So it is. Now, Sue kindly did some boards for me, and I'll just show you the boards as we go. So we're going to wait. Oh, no. Ah, uh, no. Move it, out of, move it out of the way. Okay. Oh, there it is. So, so you've been waiting for this, haven't you? This is pretty, pretty, pretty. Each dies. 
So what do we get and how do we do it? All right. Let's turn it around that way for a start. Now, this is your pocket. So it's uh, scalloped around the top. It's plain around the edge. And then you have score lines down here. All right. So it's going to cut the whole thing out for you. And then this one sits inside here to kind of give you, can you see it? So you, if you cut it out on blue, you'll wrap it in either way. And then the yellow will sit inside, yeah? Okay. And then you get your two sides. So that goes into these pieces here. So this is for you to now decide. You can decide um, if you want to put them on, if you don't want to put them on, if you want them in the same colour, if you want to raise them up, if you want that in the background, if you don't want to use that, if you want to use that and that together, if you want to use this and make a, a big shape. I mean, there's loads of ways you can do it. And then obviously, because we've been doing a lot of bows lately, I'm continuing the theme for mixing and matching all your bows because so many of you have enjoyed the bows. Oh, thank you. Oh, the comment's not appearing. As long as you can see the goodies. I have to keep swiping left and right. There was a note that came up saying they, they was having problems in... It wasn't in England. It was another country. So maybe it isn't just in another country. Maybe it's here as well. I can see comments. It's bizarre. Can't post comments. Oh, what's it saying here? Let me read this. Okay. Can't post comments to some destinations. Facebook groups at the moment, you can't. Facebook profiles, Twitter. That's what it's saying, bizarrely. Don't know what that means. Very strange. If you can't see on YouTube, have a look on facebook or is it facebook is a problem either way i hope you can see the product that's the main thing so we have a bow a small bow that's going to sit in the middle and then we have the this bow which isn't like one that goes around the edge this sits over the top to give you a matte layer and here are your flowers all right so here are your petals that's your leaves and then you have these little almost like tulipy looking flowers all right, and then I'll put three of them in, three different sizes. And then this little bit there sits inside your flower if you want it to. And I want there, I've given you a couple. And then these little bits here, they're to go on your base of your flower. So like you can see here, a mix and match of colours. So that is called your... Um, it's a wrap dye. Now, let me, I'm not sure, I can't show you samples because it's too early. The samples are not here yet. All right. But what I can show you is Sue did me a board of the new items. So that's number one. So this is forming part of the one day special. Okay. Facebook problem, but I think it's in the room. I should get fixed eventually. Um, hopefully you can come across to YouTube because you should see the comments on YouTube. That might help. Okay. So the board, here, here's your board. So you probably can't see the lines. I might see if I can, uh, you might see them there. Look at the top. Can you see that line there and there? Fingers crossed. And then you've got, there's your flowers, there's all your pieces, but obviously you can do them in different colours. There's your two bows and there's your bit that sits in the middle. And there's your pieces you're going to fit inside, okay? Isn't it lovely? Really easy. Just a just a great, great, great idea. Highlights me. This is just such a lovely dye. Very, very different. But as you know, you've got probably stuff, you've probably got stuff that it's going to work with already. All right. Thank you for liking and sharing. Thank you, Sharon. Okay. So, number two. Number two. Oh, man, I love this. Right. Right. This is going to, this is going to just, this is gorgeous. Wait till you see what I'm going to show you for this. Mm -mm. Sorry, I had to have a little drink there. 
I do apologize. This is <laughs> this flower was cream, but when it when it went to print, it doesn't seem to have come out cream, it's come out white, so it almost looks like there's something missing. <laughs> Yeah, hop on over to YouTube. That might be the best place to look. Let me just check um, while I'm here. I'm just going to go into YouTube. Bear with, bear with just for a second. Don't go anywhere. I'm just going to make sure my settings are correct on YouTube. One moment. Do not disappear, anybody. Let's check my content. Let me... Oh, where is it? Live. Let's check. Yeah, all's looking good. Thank you. Right, thanks, Miriam. Okie dokie. So let's go into this one. Pop this one to one side. This is so, so cool. Right. Hi, Jan. Hi, Owen. Okay. Let's, let, how do we do this? Right, let's do this. Okay. <laughs> show you the back, show you the front, and I'm going to move it to one side. So these are cracking little flowers, cracking little flowers. So you're going to get 16, 16 dies. So these are a gorgeous, gorgeous size, all of these. The largest flower is about six centimeters so they're really really lovely flowers and they go all the way down into cute little ditty flowers you kind of get left and right so if they're the same flower they are gorgeous these are great for for cutting on your color cardstock these are great with your little centers big black centers these are like lovely black eyed susans these are going to be great if you've um funky flowers they're great if they're scrunched up and with water and, and opened out again they are just super lovely but I mean that for me would be a little bit boring wouldn't it but Joe they are very retro aren't they they're cool um, and that will lead me on to um, something coming out not till October but we obviously need some papers and things to work with it well don't we just saying so um just be aware there are things coming for this to work with it as well so yeah so hopefully if anyone's anyone's not getting comments and you've joined a little bit later youtube is the place to go okay come and join me on youtube so you get your you get your dies and you get your all your, all your gorgeous little bits in your dies and then we get these oh look at them look at these look at these look at these i adore these i've got to tell you these are probably my favorite it's ever stamps that i've created I know I keep saying that I love all of what I create, but I do utterly love these. So what I'm going to do, bring these in like that, look at them. So you have got, can you cut, yes, you can cut them. The, the, our dies cut really well on felt. If you've got a, if you've got a high uh, wool content, it really loves them. So please, honestly, that they will work beautifully. They'll be great for some applique and all sorts of things. So your flowers are, are absolutely lush. Look at these beauties. So you get your two. So you. So I can't speak now. So basically, you're going to get a flower, two flowers for every die. Okay. So you're going to get the that's the largest, obviously, which goes with the largest there. And then you've got a matching one, although it doesn't look like it. It is the same as well. So what you'll find is you can. You can use these, stamp these in pink, stamp these in yellow, stamp these in pastel blue, layer them up. They'll be so cool. You know, stamp these in black, it's great. But for me, what I would do with those, right, my idea about these, I'll tell you, what, tell you where my idea came from. Let me move that out of the way a minute. My idea came from, sorry if I'm rambling a bit, but I got excited by these. So what I thought, if I open this, and I don't know if you guys have noticed, but my stamps are a lot easier to get off the back in now. A lot easier. Much easier. So, what I thought was, you're going to put your black ink on that one, yeah? So, pop your black ink on it. Take the other one. Pop it on a stamping block. And kiss it onto that one so it kind of pulls off some of the ink you've put on so you'll have dots within all the stripes as well do you see what I mean 
I think that will be cool absolutely cool and then you get obviously you can see here you're going to get all let me put that back on because it's it's not making it easy Hang on. i haven't even started any samples with you these there that's they're that new so then you get all your middles as well and remember they're going to work with the dies so you get all your bits to go with all the bits and they've all got a couple of mil offset as well so you're going to get a nice white edge to all of them as well they're going to be so pretty and oh my days where is that gone again oh my days they they all burst out of your your pocket yeah all of them come out of your your wrap now the thing is about these is they are called the floral pocket petals now they were called that because they were designed to go with our nested pockets but I took the nested pockets on at Christmas for Christmas, didn't I? And I took them on with the poinsettias and the foliage. So just remember your nested pockets, these are going to work beautifully with because that is what they were designed to do. All right. So that's those and that's those. Now we need something to go with those. I mean, they look super pretty as they are. Let me show you just the samples of those, though. There we go. <laughs> so look at them. They're the cutest ever, aren't they? And that's just been done in black by Sue. So you get that lovely, lovely edge to them as well. So that you're going to get that really nice outer edge. So step, do you see what I mean? So if you stamp that on top of that, you it would lift out some of the dots as well. It would be just so cool can't comment on youtube oh just have to watch me unfortunately <laughs> but yeah they look super pretty so you get your little speckled dots you're going to get your stripy ones you're going to get all your other elements and you're going to get your leaves as well all of them are standalone none of them necessarily need the stamps but they work beautifully with the stamps so those two are our first two items okay i think they're super pretty super pretty so what do we need to go with those in my opinion, we need something, you know, it's, it's lovely to have the flowers, but it would be great if we have things poking out of our flowers. Oh, I love this. I am just utterly, utterly in love with this. Um, net, oh, I'll talk to you about nested pockets in a minute, um, Emma. Bear with, bear with. So this is just the most gorgeousest, gorgeousest, gorgeousest dice set ever now when we open this now start thinking about your petals start thinking about your pockets start thinking about your wrap start thinking about how you can have these poking out of the top they are so cool so what you can now do they look like little lollipop sticks don't they but they're not so you get your left and your right in your hearts they're so pretty. They're a lovely size as well. And they're so delicate. Wait till you see them in a minute. So, oh, I'll take that one off. So, they're a good size. So that's my hand. Oh, thanks, Laura. Thank you. So, you're going to get your left and right of that one. I absolutely adore these. And then you're going to get all these ones. And what I wanted these to be is these are so like you know you used to get the hat pins and things i wanted those but i wanted you to be able to pop them into your into the like here hang on let me bring it back do you see what i mean about it all working together so when you pop your flowers for example so you're going to pop your flowers out of your pocket and then all the little hearts will come out and fill in all those gaps almost like the foliage i absolutely adore these and then these these sit over the top look, like so so you can change the color of your tops all right and then you've got a bigger one as well all right so they're all in different angles you've got four different ways they go but you've got your left and your right for both they're not quite the same and then you get these i adore these now these cut out cut um i'll show you the pictures in a minute these are solid and these ones cut out a little frame, okay? So you can, they're so beautiful. Oh, let me, I'm gonna show you, let me just show you. It might be easier. So when you see this, look at them. So these are your solids, 
so pretty this aren't they karen i really love these so all your little hearts the ones that come out you can paper piece back in if you want to you don't have to or you can use these on top of these if you want to you can pull your hearts off and just use your flourishes you've got your little stems at the bottom and then you've got your little hearts that will go over the top of your stems as well and i absolutely adore these and that i just love that that cut that a few times make a really, really pretty frame with that or that would be the foliage in a, in a mirror card um, poking at the back of your of your um of your flowers so this again thinking about the nested pocket builder as well they're going to be absolutely perfect but aren't they pretty just a little bit different and i adore these so i think you'll find they work together amazingly oops hang on a minute oh, i'm gonna drop stuff hope i'm not talking too long guys i might have, to, might have to have another little drink in a minute so let me recap on on the main bundle okay it, this isn't everything sorry to say um but let me recap on the main bundle so what you're gonna get let's start from the beginning let's start from the beginning so you're gonna get your for anybody who's just joined you see so many ways to use the hearts honestly now so, so that's your main pocket and it's a lovely size so i don't think i've got my have i got a ruler i don't think i have um a lot of you've got my glue haven't you so oh let me get a wonder brush because you've all got wonder brushes i know you have well a lot of you have so there's a wonder brush next to it, all right? Bring that down a little bit. So it's from the tip of your wonder brush just to where that little circle bit is there. So it's a nice, good size. It's a good size, all right? So you got that. Um, so that's your, it's a wrap. Oh, these will all be available separately as well. You've then got your stamps, okay, which are these beauties with the dies okay and then we've got the last one which are those all right so let's, the pocket is a child's rocket as <laughs> actually yes, it is so a jet actually a heart gem would be fantastic it would be wouldn't it so i think this is a very useful collection now bear in mind the pocket and the the wrap we have got other florals coming they are here but i'm not overloading you all at once right that's that okay so alongside that now i can give you a pocket i can let you make this but you need something to put it on don't you we need to start thinking about our backgrounds and what else we can do so we've got two stencils coming as well two brand spanking new stencils and these are gorgeous that's this one let me start with this now what is so cool about these is let me do this let me do this oh i love these so all right now let's let's open these for you honestly i'm showing you everything i only posted these to create and craft yesterday so this is you use it with your ultimate, but there's only three in this set. So if you haven't got the ultimate, why not? <laughs> no, I'm joking. If you haven't got the ultimate, um, you can use these without. Let me find a piece of black card. I'm so glad I did the live tonight because I was having an R in, but you look, you guys make me feel better. It's just so nice to spend some time with you all. It really is. So let's have a look. You can see through it already. So your first layer, there's no numbers on these, and they are cut right to the edge, okay? Oh, actually, there is a number on these. Is there a number? Oh, my man is so good. Yes, he has numbered them for me. I didn't even ask him to. He's just done it for me. So number one, okay, see, that works on its own, doesn't it? It doesn't even have to be with anything else. Number two. I mean, that's gorgeous if you want it to be like that. And you can turn it round if you want to. And then the second one goes over the top. Can you see where it's going? Yeah. 
so that you'll take the other one off and put that one on obviously and then the third one will give you the top pieces now so then that three different colors is going to give you oops that obviously when is the art oh, whenever the ultimate in stock i don't have any money oh it's typical isn't it tina we have got another two thousand arriving so they should be they won't be here till october though but honestly we've got mm, no don't speak lisa yeah they are arriving with other things <laughs> so um yeah pinks yellows and blues you know summer colors candy floss colors super pretty so that's that one so you can use these these are available on their own a bit of geometric is brilliant isn't it so in the background they're going to be great so you've got diamonds if you want diamonds you've got diamonds the opposite way they're not the same because we, you can't do them the same because if i turned it that way it wouldn't line up properly but it will give you a different pattern see that so actually the reason we do them like this is because hang on where's number that's number three that's number two so number three i tried to do it so i flipped it over and it will give me the other piece that i needed if that makes sense but it doesn't but if we if we put that on you get a different pattern. you get that pattern yeah but if you turn it that way see what i mean where it lines up with the holes you get a different pattern okay and then that one if you put it with that one you can get a pattern that way put it that way and it does your blocks again this is cool really cool love that so you can buy that one on its own or you can buy it with the other one now the other one is a little bit different and i'm going to talk you through this this is <laughs> this is cool this is cool all right love this you're gonna get a lot of use out of this i will say i would be making sure you have some low tech masking tape as well though because this has been i tried to make the most of the areas of your stencils now because they're lined they're a little bit more flexible okay you get a lot in here you get five in here okay that stencil, Joanna, is lovely. So this is where you do sit up. Mm. Oh, Christina, thank you. Yes, it's close enough. Well, I am a South London girl, actually. I was born and bred in Bromley. So I am a South London girl. Right. So this looks very strange. Look, very strange. Very strange. But every line is different so we go number one i love that as a stencil on its own okay now what i will say is because they're inked right to the edge you will find that you're going to ink over the edges there is no getting away for that however once it's in your platform if you want to you can tape them down the sides feel free to tape them down the sides now these are six by six so you, you're probably going to trim them down anyway so i wouldn't worry too much okay so that's number one let's show you let me go through them um, individually so then then you get smaller lines all right smaller lines oh whereabouts in bromley are you suzanne i was in uh, um um, I live well. I lived a load of places in Bromley, actually, but the bottom of um, Westmoreland Road down the bottom of the hill, and then you get different size lines. Keep going, then you get thin lines. So these are great for journaling as well if you wanted them to be. There we go, and even thinner lines. Now this is where it gets interesting. So what you would do, because because these do go to the edge and quite to the top of your platform just have to be a little bit more careful in some of these areas but it is it's use your stencil brush in there take these down if you want to and it'll make it a lot easier so just a frothy comment i used to live in brewery road you know where the uh, petrol garage is oh my goodness what a small world okay my brother went to ravenswood school as well so <laughs> there we go so um that's the first one now that's number five 
So number four, when we put that down, you can see the lines are different, yeah. Number three, this took me ages, Heather, but I love this. Number two, now that, sorry, number three, now that goes over the top of one and four if you want it to, okay? Oh, Suzanne, obviously, we're, you're a local. I, I, yeah, my mum and dad are in Petswood as well. But we're having, I'm having a chat in between. So number two covers up the other lines, and number one gives you open areas. Now, that is not that is not where it ends. So what you can now do, if you want to, obviously, we've only got the pegs one way. That is changing for some upcoming designs as well. We're gonna, we've got pegs everywhere, <laughs> holes everywhere. So what you can now do if you want to, so there's number one, you can take number two. See, I know they're a bit floppy, but you can now pop it over the top, just line your corners up, ink through if you want. And then you've got number three, if you wanna put it back on that way, and ink through and if you want to turn it that way and ink through and if you want to turn it that way and ink through obviously you are not going to get it the ink perfect everywhere I mean that looks great as well like that doesn't it so all I would say to you is is you're going to probably have to cut out and and not worry about the edges so much it's never going to be a perfect science but it's the only way i could do it to give you options so five let's let's not do four let's do three so again another look so you can keep going but there's loads and loads of ways of using just be careful because you have got open edges pull your ink rather than doing that because you're going to because they're quite big gaps all right but i just thought what a what a cracking idea if you want to do something like your plaid or your because they're great for Christmas or um stripes or checks or you want to use it for journaling loads and loads of ideas all right so that's your other one that's five in that set that's your other one so that's your new 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 items now the next few items are going to be new for some people some people who have only recently started to follow me. And that is some stamps that I bought out about a year ago. It might even been longer than that. And I've re just reordered them because people kept asking me about them. Sorry. Drinking the game. So who remembers this beauty? What a stamp. Dawn Surderfield, it's her favourite stamp of all time. Not that she's told many people, other than most of the world. She uses it often in her lives. And some of the team haven't even seen this stamp because they're newer on the team, but they love it. So on the back, you're going to get, and I'll be truthful, this is Danny's design. Danny designed this. You're going to get, don't worry about them being square because it's only going to pick up the areas in black so you don't get a square edge. So you're going to get... Um, splats there almost like rusty looking bits there you're going to get a, a script that you can repeat and then you're going to get a larger splat with some some smaller details now these are going to sit behind your flowers these are going to give you a little bit of texture on your card these are going to be absolutely beautiful and they are something like 10.99 i think they're gorgeous absolutely gorgeous so that's number one number two is possibly my favorite is this now me me i love this check a tablecloth in my opinion check a tablecloth stamp your look cracking look at that checkered checkered do you know what Get your dark, oh, now look, see, now I've just discovered something I didn't even think about. Grab your flowers. Oh, look at, go on. Stamp it out. Cut your flowers out in this. Oh, man, that's going to be gorgeous. Another way of using those. Now, that's number two. Again, they're all 10 99 okay? 
we have another one. Now this, when you, when you, this is probably one of the first stamps I ever bought out to the point that it hasn't even got a code number on it and the barcodes um, are not EAM barcodes that we use worldwide now. This is just, you know, this, these are stuff that I bought out in my early days, but when, before many people knew me, to be honest, so so pretty such a pretty gorgeous in red for christmas as well that's number two number three number three oh, music notes doesn't say anything we've had people try to play this it doesn't say anything but it is gorgeous now this can be for christmas if you want it to be this is great oh this this is a background all across the back he would be shouting out gingham he would be wouldn't he um, stamp it twice because you can repeat this pattern across makes a gorgeous background with your flowers on top with your petals and your pocket it's just absolutely glorious it really is glorious is that one and finally hi Susie don't worry about being late oh no it's not finally I've got two more there's this one and this one again Danny made this one now it looks very strange there let me turn that over this is gorgeous. You can't really read it. You can't really read what it says. But this stamp, right, what's cool about this is I want you to take a piece of cream card. I want you to stamp this in brown ink. And then I want you to cut it out because it's only a square. It's got the square edge. It's got the square edge. And then you're going to tear it. It is beautiful. Um, Claire, these are all coming to air on the 26th at 6 p.m. So that's the four stamps. OK, some of you may have these, but many of you I know will not. So we've only got 300 of those. So just be aware when they're gone, they're gone. And then finally, we have this. This is... Oh, this is my ticker, my ticker that I bought out. I think it was my first show, one of my first shows on telly. And it has been so popular. And I, and I kind of discontinued it. And then um, about a month or two ago, I kept thinking, I really want to use them and I can't because I've discontinued them. So I undiscontinued them. So these are your ticker phrases. I did something similar with creative expressions. I did ticker words, but I absolutely love that. So you get a lot of use out of that. So returning favourites are going to be um, oh, I don't think you gave me the padded quilt. The padded quilt in Boston Folder, if you don't have it, is coming back to Crate and Craft. Um, also, when will the stamps only be on Crate and Craft? They will all be, all of those will be on the 26th Mary so we've got the paddy quilt which isn't up here and we have the Alstroemeria and the water droplets to make some great backdrops and then back by popular demand we finally got this back and then we have not many but I thought these were great in the pockets and I bought these back because I think they're going to be perfect if you want a different kind of bow that is the Crate and Craft show for the one day special. Then, very quickly, because time is getting on, and I want to say hello to you all again, or goodbye to you all. Um, then we have Craft Extra, and we've got, because we've got four hours to demo, four hours to demo. So we're going to be using random things, and I've picked out things that people have been asking me about. So I've been asked about this a lot about how you use that these okay special prices remember special prices on craft extra i can't i can't tell you enough that it will be special prices okay remember when we did the words last week on telly thank you congratulations and kindness special prices this isn't special price but there's a reason this is on i'll tell you in a minute I'll talk inks in a minute. I promise, promise, promise. This is a special price. I've got a lot of them. I've ordered a lot in. But Christmas, Christmas, you need them for Christmas. They're going to be beautiful with these if you'd already bought them. I'm going to go into a full in-depth 
uh, demonstration how you use your envelopes, okay, and all the elements that go with it. So the extra show is on the 28th, and it's at 10 and 11 and 1 and 2. So you've got four hours of me with one hour break in between. So that's coming. We then have these. I've never got to demo these, never got to demo them. We've also got these, and I can spend time on showing you how to do some inking. And anyone who missed my colouring in the um, bars, I'm going to go through all that again because I've got time to do it on air. And then, okay, these are going to be special prices, okay? And... Do you remember I did washi tape to go with these? So these are last year's. I think these came out last June with a washi, with 15 metres of washi, okay? These are limited, 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 limited stocks, what we have. But you can buy it like this if you want to on a special deal. Or you can buy them on their own, all right? But we don't have thousands of these because they are end of line, those end of line. When they are gone, they will not be reprinted. They will not be coming back. And then finally, we have a brand new Christmas stencil, which is a three slimline layering stencils, which is going to go with the um, slimline pocket envelope um, with the um check frame all of those so they're going to be really really handy but this is craft extra exclusive all right okay so if you've got stuff that you're not using and you want to get a spare one be aware craft extra and when they are gone they're gone so that is what is coming up to tell you i'm just trying to give you lots of heads up let me bring you back Oh, I can't sit, I sit like that now. I can't talk to, can't talk to you like that. <laughs> oh, no, it's fun joking. Um, Kristen, I like the cost, but I'm sure we won't get it in the US if they are in blind. I don't know how they're splitting the stock. They normally do split some for US, but I don't know what they'll do. I don't. Um, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I can promise you there's new good stuff coming. That's all I can promise you, if I can. Um, so, I turned your back so I want to chase them in. And what did I want to tell you? I've forgotten. Ah, right. So, you know the 26th. You know the 27th because it's the rest of the one day special. You now know the 28th. Then... I've been asked quite a few questions, so let, I'm going to answer some of these questions now, if I can. How do you order off, off Craft Extra? If you go back up in the comments, Shirley, somebody said you press the red button when you're on one of the channels, but I can't remember what it was. So let me... Oh, thank you, Sherry. Bubble Squares, Karen, are reordered thing is what I have to do is do a significant reorder so I've got plenty to ship in otherwise it gets really expensive because most of my deliveries come by air which is the, the most expensive way to bring it into the country um we have got um an ocean shipment coming and I've <laughs> another, oh many of you will know this and will laugh another container is coming but it won't be here till October so we won't talk about that one yet. Lots on that one. Lots on that one. So you keep asking me about the stencils to go with the poppy, to go with the fairy pedestals and that. I keep saying they are in the air. They are on their way. So just bear with me. I'm trying to allocate the show to them, but I'll tell you in a bit, bit more in a minute about the shows that are coming up. So they are on their way. The ink pads are in the same are, are in the same boxes they are on their way with some other things they were delayed by um i think it was a week i thought they'd left but they they hadn't left because there was problems finding a flight 
I don't even know why. And then they got held up in Hong Kong. I mean, it's come, I don't know why, but something to, it's um, they came by FedEx because not that you need to even know this, but shipping certain products like inks and liquids, which are the reinkers, um, they work better coming via, I think it's FedEx than DHL or something. There was a, there was a, anyway, they are all on the plane. They are all coming. Then they need to clear customs and get to me. So the situation is that they are on their way, but we obviously have this show on the 26th. I'm led to believe the end of the month is when everything is landing and will be with me. So, um, yeah, so that's a, a couple of weeks. The ink pads, because of the shipping of them, half of them are coming by air, the other half are coming by sea. So the quantity, all right, so not half the colours. Um, half of everything is coming. So what I'm going to suggest to you, when it does come to air, when it does come to air, if you can get what you want, then great. If you miss it, do not fret. October, the other half will be here, okay? So you will get everything. If you don't get it in August, you will get it in October, all right? I can promise you that much, right? Is Danny moving out in October? I think it might be me moving out. Finally got my hands on your Christmas collection in the US scrapbook. Excellent. Oh, I'm so pleased you've managed to get hold of more stuff over than the States. It's really good news. Um, more is coming. A lot more is coming for you guys. Um, yeah, what was the other question? Um, that was ink pads. Just at the bottom, can anybody remind me? Nesting pockets. Now, I thought the nested pockets were on this show. Let me just check something on my computer. So you can see me, but I can't see you for a minute. Let me just type in something. Um, 26 or... Oh. Let me, no, that's the wrong one, 20, that's 26 of another month. Let's have a look very quickly, very quickly, where is it? Right. It's a wrap. Floral pockets, blah, blah, blah. Textures, textures, blah, 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 blah. Cast from area, dot, blah, blah, Textured cardstock. Nested pocket builder. Yes. Nested pocket builder is on the 20th. Let me come back to you so I can see you all. Nested pocket builder is on the 26th. So you'll definitely get it there. Okay. So... Poppies, I've just answered. Excited about the ink pads. Is Danny moving out? No, I'll be moving out. Lots more is coming to HSN as well for you guys in the States. I'm not saying anything else. I'm not saying anything else, but yes, things are coming to HSN, which is very good. Very, very, very good. And something's happening. I'm doing something with scrapbook.com in July. Um, look out for something that you might be able to get your hands on in the States that you can't get here. OK, um, I'm going to go in a second. So I just want to check. Building next door. No, 30 days aren't up yet. They haven't decided if they're moving out, which is very annoying. OK, yeah, I've got to be very careful, Miriam. Shush me, shush me, shush me. I'm um, just going to go very back, very quickly to see if I've missed anything. Bubble squares have been ordered. Um, I think the envelope demo, Sandra. Honestly, it's such. Honestly, it's one of those that you think you don't want, and then you see it and you go, "I know why she made that." 
um inks yeah so i've answered the inks great craft i probably miss things and i apologize if i do but i will go back and have a look and i do need i've got a message from dawn and miriam right but yep thank god for my girls thank god for my girls i can't tell you much about hsn that will be coming for the for you guys in the states and other places what i can tell you about though is the 8th of august please put this date in your diary i've seen enough comment i need to answer in a minute as well okay <laughs> um 8th of august diary box kit magazine number three now I'm doing a monthly mega deal on the box kit. So it's going to be available all month. <laughs> I don't even last a day, let alone a month. I'm doing my best. I've got a lot. Lot, 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 lot. Should last. Should last. We do have exclusive elements. So you can buy your box kit magazine on its own before it gets to the supermarket. But you can also buy the box kit magazine with two exclusive exclusive elements which are beautiful you will not be able to get them separately you will not get them in the supermarket don't open your box kit if you bought it on its own and think you're going to get the extras you are not there is a limited number of the exclusive kits and they are exclusive to create and craft for a month okay the exclusive kits not the individuals the exclusive kits so you need to keep an eye out for that that's 7 a.m in the morning and 11 a.m and i'm gone just two hours but there are new products that go with it okay so that is the seventh after that there was something else i'm meant to be answering that the girls have told me then i do want to talk to you about the 24th of august it's crack and craft's birthday i can't say any more than that just at this moment but yes okay so nested bubble squares in rectangles i've drawn them not submitted them yet that means they will be six to eight weeks probably but they're drawn okay is there anywhere that's got magazine number one no and, I, and guess what my supplier a practical publishing emailed me and said do i need any more box kit two or three and i said no i said have you got any of number one i will bite your arm off for number one there's not a number one anywhere i can find anywhere i don't know if you can pick one up on ebay i haven't been able to find one anywhere i haven't even got one myself i gave mine away and it was opened and used so if you can get one good luck but that box kit number one i'm bringing out some papers which are a very similar style we're talking about the retro and the flowers so please 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 keep an eye out that will be in october though so just just so you know um i think that's all i can tell you at the moment I'm going to let you go because it's only 10 past 8. It's a nightmare to get hold of, isn't it? Absolute nightmare. So it's everything's very exciting at the minute. Very, very exciting. Remember, there are two craft channels. Now, will your box kit survive? Oh, good. Oh, God knows if it's going to survive. It's a cool box kit because if you're not into Christmas, but you are into Christmas and you want a bit of non-Christmas, you want a bit of Christmas, it's a perfect box kit. It is gorgeous. It's a gorgeous colour palette. It is just got some lovely, lovely things in it. You know I love my box kits. The exclusives are amazing. And the what I call the upsells that go with the box kit, you are going to love them. Okay, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> Search the universe for it. Where are the box kits going to be sold? First of all, they're going to be on Crate and Craft exclusively as a, a bundle. But we will have the box kit. If you just want the box kit, on its own that will also be available on create and craft and then i think it's a week later they go into your local supermarket your local wh smiths your um Mar is it martins i call it it's a few stores it goes into i'm not sure about hobby craft but i think um well my mum and dad found it in most of the supermarkets bless their heart um 
yeah okay 14.99 box kit and i think that is all i need to show you i think it is i think it is just checking on the comments there no that is it i think so what we need to do is what i didn't do last week is announce a winner miriam dawn have you got me a winner for this week so the winner this week you must have liked you must have shared and you must have commented whether it's on youtube whether it's on facebook whether it's anywhere you can comment don't mind where it is as long as i can see that you've watched the video you can win boobity boobity boo boobity boobity boo you're gonna win you're gonna win you're gonna win you're gonna win that 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 oh is it my one that scrapbook now that and that okay so all of those are going to be for one lucky winner so i'm just going to wait for the girls to message me let me just check who said about the um that's the scrapbook just sorry i've missed it now i've got the, my comments are just flying free to div that's all i can see it free stencil at scrapbook right now that is not going to last long if it's mine it's not going to last long there are a few thousand of those i can tell you that much oh fabulous so in this if you're in the states please go and grab that it's um exclusive to scrapbook.com not available anywhere else in the world you'll never get it ever 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 it's for you guys as a big big thank you okay for supporting me so winner okay so the girls have had a look and the winner is do 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 oh lost it again laura penman so laura congratulations you have won the prize okay bye hayley thank you so laura penman if you're still here you are please could you message dawn or miriam um, and you will win that. We had a bit of a mishap last week because it was Susan Robson and we found we had two Susan Robsons. <laughs> that wasn't very clever, was it? But if your name was Susan Robson, <laughs> you were lucky. <laughs> so congratulations. Um, so finally, you know the dates, the 26th for the one day special and then the 28th for the craft extra four hours. And um, thank you. For sticking with me thank you for joining in all my lives thank you for voting for me thank you for nominating me to even to know you can vote thank you for putting me up there with the most incredible crafters on the planet i am eternally grateful danny's grateful too we've got um customer service nomination as well which is phenomenal designer of the year woman of the year uh, best die cutting range um blog i'm not sure i win for the blog because i don't really but yeah it's, i think they're meant more social media um but yeah I, i'm super pleased and a craft shop as well best craft shop that craft place so thank you thank you thank you and if you're happy to continue to vote um thank you for your support that's all i can say anyway i'm glad i came on you you've made me feel so much better and um i'm gonna go and now hide in a little corner and uh uh, take my tablets and try and feel a bit better for the shows on the 26th so i'll see you next friday we can do some demos with the new goodies that will be released next friday at 6 p.m so just a week to wait and then you can grab your goodies and um yeah we'll do some demos and have a good time so have a lovely weekend everybody stay safe and stay out of the sun it's going to be 35 degrees by monday keep drinking and i'll see you later take care bye everyone <laughs>